What's up, burritos, and welcome to Game Dev Tycoon. In this business of simulation, you've been transported back in time to start your very own game development company right at the beginning of the PC revolution. In the next 35 years, you can build your dream company, create best-selling games, gain fans, and become the leader of the market. So let's go ahead and get started. <coughs> oh, ah, dying. <coughs> Sorry. Before you can start your adventure, you have to give your upcoming company a name. Okay. Um. Huh. Hmm. What should we go with? I, um. Huh. Uh, oh, man. I'm drawing a blank, guys. Uh, let's see. Chalupa. Probably didn't spell that right. Chalupa Inc. And I am Carne Asada. Awesome. Yeah, works for me. Close enough. All right. Since you played the game before, you can choose to use all the previously gained hints in the new game. Would you like to import all previously gained hints into this game? No! We're gonna start from Skirch. Alright, so first things first, we need to develop a new game. So, let's pick a topic. Zombie, transport, surgery, and hospital. Uh, what genres do we have? Let's do a, uh, zombie action game for the PC. And we're going to call it, uh, hmm, hmm, what would be a good name for a zombie game that isn't already taken? Um, ooh, ooh. Uh, man, okay. Nice! 2D graphics, V1. The iPhone release simulator, a zombie action game. Um, I think for action games, engine is important, gameplay is pretty important, and story and quests aren't very important. Dude. Do, 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 do. So we're working on the engine now. Gameplay. Excuse me while I enjoy my morning coffee. Uh, level design. Yeah, dialogues not so much, and artificial intelligence. Okay. We gotta we gotta get Siri in there, right? All right. And then I feel like. Graphics are important, and sound not so much. Because, I mean, there's no headphone jack anymore, right? Uh, can we get an extra point in here? Yep. Let's finish up. Boop. New topic, new combo, so I got a bonus. So let's see what we got. Nothing leveled up, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and release it. Wait for some reviews. The reviews on our newly released game, iPhone Release Simulator, have come in. Uh, uh, it shows potential. Okay. Oh god. They shouldn't forget about sound. <laughs> no, they shouldn't. Has its moments. Five. Their focus on graphics served this game very well. All games. Okay, so I didn't make a total flop, but it wasn't very good either. Chalupa Inc., a newcomer in the game industry, has just released their first game, iPhone Release Simulator. The game has a moderate response from reviewers. We are curious what Chalupa Inc. will deliver in the future. Probably more trash. <laughs> Let's figure out what we did wrong. iPhone Release Simulator sold 3,473 units in its first week on the market. We made it the charts as number 95. <laughs> Yay! iPhone Release Simulator was so successful that we now have 26 fans. Woo! 
Sounds like a good day. Our post analysis or post release analysis of iPhone release simulator is complete and we got the following results. Zombie and action is a great combination. World design seems to not be very important for this type of game. Ah, uh, there is our problem. Should have focused on sound instead of world design. Oopsies. Well, I guess we better jump into a new game, like, immediately. Um, what do we got? Hospital? Hospital simulation. Alright. And, uh, colonial clinic. You know, like General Hospital. It's Colonel Clinic. <laughs> <laughs> for the PC. Uh, 2D graphics. So this is a simulation. This is this is going to be interesting. This is not something we've really done before. Um, I think engine and gameplay are still the most important in this. Do 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 do. Uh, artificial intelligence. And not so much on level design, because it's a simulator, so you want the AI to be smart, right? At least I think that's how it works. Um... I feel like world design is not as important, and sound and graphics are way more important for a simulator. I could be horribly wrong. I probably am. iPhone release simulator is now off the market. It sold 9,702 units, generating $67,000 in sales. Okay, that's not bad. Alright, so we're all done with this, so let's go ahead and clear out some bugs and see if we can get a buff in design or tech, maybe? Recent market studies suggest that the Govador G64 is steadily outselling competitors in the PC sector. Consumers prefer the lower price, greater availability, and the flexible hardware configuration over other home computers. Experts say this might spell the end of competing hardware manufacturers. I'm gonna have to disagree. <laughs> Bing! New record. New topic, new combo. Uh, anything level up yet? Nope. So let's release this and pray that the reviewers are nicer to me. The first reviews of our newly released game, Colonel Clinic, have come in. Ooh! Ooh! Very enjoyable! Oh. Quirky, but good. The hell, Game Informer. Enjoyable. Yeah, can I get another 8? Played it for days! All games. All right. It wasn't as bad this time. Uh, so let's go ahead and generate a game report on Colonel Clinic. Colonel Clinic has achieved a company sales record with over 10,000 units sold. This is an important milestone in the history of Chalupa Inc. Hey, we're ranked 39. We're way better than we were before. Our post-release analysis of Colonel Clinic is complete, and we got the following results. Hospital and simulation is a great combination. Sound seems to be quite important for this type of game. And platform genre match, PC simulation, great. I, di I did okay. I did okay. This is good. Alright, so let's go ahead and research some new topics. Virtual pet. Okay. According to rumors, the Japanese company Ninvento is planning to launch its very own home gaming console. Ninvento is known for the widely successful arcade game, Dinky King. Many industry experts doubt that home gaming consoles will take off, but we are eager to see what Ninvento will deliver. Oh, we'll find out, won't we? The music for this is so amazing. You have successfully researched a new topic, Virtual Pet. Alright, so let's see what, if we can get anything else off of this. Life? Hmm. Well, we could, we could do Vampire and maybe do like, 
a vampire RPG. That might work well. <clears throat> Colonel Clinic is off the market. It sold 20,000 units, generating $150,000 in sales. Woo! Damn, did great. I don't know, on a high note like that, I think we should end the episode here. So, this has been Game Dev... Oh, you've successfully researched a new topic, Vampire. Alright. So, anyway, this has been Game Dev... This has been Game Dev Tycoon. I've been Carne, and I'll see you in the next video. Adios.